pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. thing about First Right Empires International, or otherwise known as VEI, is that it feels like I'm a part of a business, and I had to wear a suit and go to an interview, and it was a really good life experience, and uh, I, I'm like a part of a firm, and I have my own job, it's really cool working with like a team of people. Hello Geneva, I'm Luke Matan. And I'm Nick Elliott, and it is show we will continue CTE Spirit Week and have a brand new Sports Shield report. All that and so much more, because, because GTV, GTV News starts right, right now. now. Here are your morning announcements for Tuesday, December 5th, 2023. As you can see, today's Spirit Day is dressed like your favorite duo or trio to show teamwork. And tomorrow's Spirit Day is business on the top and PJs on the bottom for remote work day. There's been a lot of action on the hardcore and the mats. GTV's Aaron Medina brings us more in today's Sports Shield Report. Aaron? Let's go over this week in Geneva sports. It was a basketball bonanza as both our boys and girls played at home. It was one loss and one win, so let's take a quick look at some highlights. Next up, the boys team will take on Lake Park High School tomorrow from 7 to 9 p.m. Meanwhile, the girls team will play at home tomorrow against Lake Park. It will be in the contest game from 7 to 9 p.m. JV dance team performed at Batavia on Saturday and won, and on Sunday they also won at Naperville North. Varsity and JV will competing at Oswego this coming Saturday. Our varsity gymnastics team has a home meet this Wednesday versus Lake Park. It will begin at 6.30 in the Mac Olson Gym. The boys varsity wrestling team will have a meet against Lake Park High School on Thursday. On Friday, they beat Wheaton Warrenville South. The boys swim team has a meet this Saturday the 9th. The opponent will be announced at a later time. Now let's watch Geneva sink the competition. The boys varsity and JV bowling teams have a game today after school. From 46 against Oswego High School at Parkside Bowl. Now let's hope they strike out the opponent. And that's the sports news from today. So back to you at the deck. Thanks, Aaron. To prep for finals week, world language, world language, social studies, science, and English teachers will be available after school from Monday, December 11th through Thursday, December 14th in the library. And therapy dogs will be available Monday, December 18th and Tuesday, December 19th for stress relief in the community room. If you are interested in any of this year's international trips, there will be an informational meeting this Thursday, December 7th from 6 to 7.30 p.m. 
The Spanish Club is meeting next Thursday, December 14th, after school in J245 to make poinsettias and eat snacks. New members are welcome. DECA is hosting a fundraiser for muscular dystrophy this week. They will be selling lemonade to raise money all throughout this week in the Commons. Be sure to support a good cause. Attention all Triumph members. Today's meeting has been postponed to next Tuesday, December 12th. If there are any questions, email Mrs. Halverson. Now, for a look at today's weather. There will be a high of 38 degrees and a low of 28 degrees. Then looking ahead at tomorrow's weather, there will be a high of 39 degrees and a low of 26 degrees with cloudy skies. And here's through to know before we go. Scaldic Club is not meeting this week. The Yuletide Festival rehearsal is tomorrow after school. As a reminder, you can now adjust your second semester classes. Check your email for more information. That's all the news we have for you today, Geneva. I'm Luke Matan. And I'm Nick Elliott. Have a terrific Tuesday.